Kavihuha accused the government of brainwashing people with the myth of not having money for the past seven years and public servants are running out of patience. He emphasized that salaries of public servants can no longer catch up with the high increasing prices of commodities or living standard. TUN says if government does not act on providing solutions, this situation may push public servants into poverty. Because in terms of the labor aid, when the employer uh, does not um, claim not to have enough money, the employer is required to open his or her book to the other party. So that the other party can scrutinize those books and ascertain themselves that there is no money. So the party mutually must sit around the table, uh, being honest to each other, being uh, negotiating in a good faith, and all of those kind of things. He added that the union does not interpret salary increment as an expenditure but an investment. Because you put that money in the pocket of an Namibian person, where does that ordinary worker take that money to? He or she take to the uh, uh, shop and he or she by taking that money to a shop pay back 15% as a VAT go back to the state, so the money circulate. He says the union is on the journey of consulting all public servants to get solutions for salary increment. Luciang Findaka, NBC News, Venduk.